Good morning, Indians. My name is Allison. And my name is Anushka. Let's get started with the pledge. Good morning, Indians. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready? Begin. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United, United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. A huge congratulations to our PSHS Teacher of the Year, Ms. Silva. We couldn't be more proud. If you see Ms. Silva, tell her congrats. PS Factor is just around the corner. PS Factor is a talent show designed for students to show off and share their incredible talents. Tickets are on sale for $5. PS Factor is next Wednesday, February 16th at 6 p.m. in the Richard Center for the Arts. Attention Indians, our school's new book club is excited to welcome you to join us. Meetings are once a month during lunch and take place the first Thursday of each month. We'll be coming together to vote on books to read before we share our thoughts at the next meeting. If you just want to hang out and listen to discussions, feel free to stop by. Your book needs your help. They need pictures. If you can please help, stop by ASB with any pictures you think we can use for the yearbook. Or email them to Mr. Brown at tbrown at psusd.us. The freshman Palm application is now open. All current freshmen that would like to be in the Palm Academy next year need to fill out the application found on the Palm Weebly website. The application must be completed by February 25th. Don't wait, Indians. CSF applications are due February 25th on Google Classroom. If you have any questions, reach out to Ms. Economos or stop by room 404. Valentine's Grams are now on sale in the quad. Get that special someone a Valentine's Gram for only $5. You get a rose, a stuffed animal, chocolate, and a card written by our calligraphy club. Fancy stuff for only five bucks? Get yours today. This week is Valentine's Spirit Week. That's right, you get to dress up all week. T today is Twin Soul Day. Wednesday is Box of Chocolates Day. Wear some brown. Thursday is Relationship Status Day. White is single, pink is situationship, and red is taken. Friday we do not have school and Monday is Valentine's Day, so spread the love by wearing something with a heart. Up next is our student produced segments. Enjoy! So, uh, are you single or do you have a girlfriend? I'm single. So, what are you doing for Valentine's Day? Uh, crying. What else? Um, playing Fortnite. Can you hit the gritty? <laughs> no. Try to hit the gritty. Uh, okay, we'll, we'll blank that out, but... Thank you. Nice gritty, nice gritty. Yeah. Uh, so, who am I here with today? Jeremiah, you already know. And Jeremiah, are you single or do you have a girlfriend? Come on, bro. Why are you gonna violate me like that? You already know I'm single. Okay, so what are you gonna do for Valentine's Day? Uh, dude, I'm just gonna be like, it's like every other day. Probably gonna play like, I don't know, Fortnite? No, 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 wait, wait. wait. Uh, I'm gonna play Warzone instead because Fortnite is. Uh, I'm not say that. Okay, since you play Fortnite, can you hit the greedy? No. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, today I'm here with huh? Jesse Cruz and. Giselle. And so you guys are the first couple we've had so far. And we want to know, what are you guys doing for Valentine's Day? Well, we're going to hang out. I'm going to buy her flowers and... <laughs> and um, have a nice dinner. Come on. Just a classy individual. That's very thoughtful of you. Very classy. Class act. Thank you. All right. Happy meal. And what is your name? Moseman. Moswin. We all know him. We all love him. Moswin, what are you going to be doing for Valentine's Day? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Probably get some presents for my girlfriend. Nah, that's about it. Very, very sweet, man. Very sweet. Yeah. Um, anything else? Like maybe like a dinner date, like a picnic? Like what's happening? Uh, probably take her to Subway and get her a, a six inch, you know? <laughs> that's about it. Very, very thoughtful night for Moswin. Um, very thoughtful night. We appreciate you. Thank you. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to you too. I, I, um, today, I'm, today I'm joined by another very classy man. What is your name? Ben. And Ben, what are you going to be doing for Valentine's Day? I don't even know. I can tell you that. <laughs> like, maybe like a dinner, maybe like a picnic. Like, what's happening? I don't know yet, man. That's 14 days away. So your girlfriend actually, <laughs> your girlfriend actually happens to be standing right there. So we're going to go ahead and invite her over here. And we're gonna ask her, what would be an ideal 
Valentine's Day for you. And she's out of here. So, so what would be an ideal Valentine's Day for you? Probably like go on a date or like, I don't know, like picnic. Like hold hands in the park? I don't know. Okay, well, I wish the best for you. And hey, happy, happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to you too. We love you. Alright, we out. Hey, bro, what? Today I'm, today I'm joined by Leader. And Leader Hoops on TikTok. We're walking with him. Alright, so Leader, your girlfriend is right over there. Uh huh. Put her real quick. <laughs> what are you and your girl gonna do for Valentine's Day? For Valentine's? Uh, bro, nothing, bro. She got strict parents, bro. It's tough. An ideal Valentine's Day, will, what would an ideal Valentine's Day look like for you? Um, I don't know, like the park, like a, a, a picnic or something. Like holding hands in the picnic? Yeah. In the park? Walking down the park, holding hands. Like, I like that idea. So, on your picnic, where would you get food from? Food? Uh, canes, probably. Canes. Or make some homemade food. I love you, leader. I love you too. I wish the best for you, and I hope that you get to have your picnic with your girlfriend. All right, Happy Valentine's Day. All right, so today I'm joined by Elijah. And Elijah, you have a girlfriend. Yeah. So what are you going to be doing for Valentine's Day? Hey, hey, hold on, hold on. I don't know. Let's cut this quick. I'm here with Luke. So I got a question for you, Luke. You got a girlfriend, right? Something like that, yeah. <laughs> so what do you have planned for Valentine's Day? So, you know, I'm just going to take a walk in the park, you know, hold her hand. Absolutely appreciate her beauty. What would an ideal Valentine's Day look like for you? Ideal Valentine's Day, that's a good question. Ideal Valentine's Day for me would probably be somewhere on the beach, like with a blanket, and just spending the whole day together. I feel like that'd be cool. Alright, well, I hope you have an amazing Valentine's Day. I hope you do too. And I love you, Elijah. Good morning, Indians. Welcome back to another episode of Fun of the Day. Today, John is back at it again with another fun for us. I'm Ryan. Did you know that French fries weren't actually made in French? They weren't? No. Where were they made? Greece. What? No way. I know. I even said French, not France. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Greece Indians. fries. Okay, no. Bye, Indians. Have a great day. <laughs> bye. That was disastrous. That was horrendous. <laughs> That's it for today, Indians. Have a wonderful day. In the silence of the desert, where the sands of silver shine, stands our glorious alma mater, tis our hymn.